this is it. The Hammers say they've received word that Constantine's descended into his realm to perform a ritual with the Eye. The Hammers have built me a booby-trapped counterfeit Eye. If I can swap it for the real thing, it should cause him some trouble. If he doesn't notice me. I've never robbed a god before. It'd be a challenge. Everybody, Beeble Bastard here, and I am honored to welcome you to the final mission of Thief Gold. And uh, let me just say it real fast that uh, for those of you who have watched this far, uh, whether you liked it or not, I can't thank you enough for uh, sticking with me here and checking these videos out. This is my first Let's Play ever, and. Uh, I am feeling a little accomplished because I didn't think I was going to get it done after uh, all this shit happened in uh, March, but uh, here we are on the last mission. And um, no yapping uh, right now. I'm just going to get straight into it. And uh, yeah, because this mission's pretty interesting. Uh, not the hardest, but it's hard in its own right. It is the final mission. So. The keepers tell you that Constantine's gone into the Maw of Chaos. You get to go in after him. <laughs> you get to go in. That's like, I like that. If you can swap the fake eye the Hammerites have made for the real eye he's using in the ritual, that should put a damper on his plans. The more beasts come through that portal, the more get through to the Hammer Temple and the city. Uh, the hammers tell you that you don't want that if you don't destroy the portal before Constantine finishes his ritual, it may remain open forever, even if the trickster's plan fails. So we got to shut the portal of all the uh, monsters coming through here as well. And uh, I don't think, yeah, this is not even a mission where you can uh, uh, prepare beforehand. Not that you really need to. Let's just see what we got. We got 20 broadhead arrows. We got our sword and blackjack as us. One water arrow, one fire arrow, one moss arrow, and one gas arrow, two rope arrows, and two noisemakers. And we don't want to use any of those elemental arrows because we need those actually for something. But, um, yeah, so this mission is, I don't, it's not straightforward. It's kind of linear, but this is all about not engaging unless you can avoid it, uh, any of the monsters that are coming through there. Um, but there's the portal, like everything's kind of coming through to get to the real world and fuck it to shreds. Uh, we will have plenty of gas arrows, kind of, um, so I guess that much is good. But again, this mission's more about hiding and stealth than it is about battling everything. For the first time in like the, net, in like the past like three missions. Because the past three were pretty heavily uh, combat and confrontation oriented. So basically what's going on is, uh, you know, periodically you're going to have these little groups of monsters coming up here. And they're all coming to invade Earth. And sometimes they're hard to see, but there's one dude up there who's kind of overlooking everything as we go. So when the coast is clear... You just move down and try to stay off the main path because it's a uh, tile and it's very loud. Uh, but there's plenty of shadows to hide in, at least at this point. And, uh, of course, as always, don't forget to save periodically. Uh, so there's that guy right there. And um, so we kind of do need to take him out. But if we do take him out... That's going to alert every uh, beast that comes up that way that sees him. But we'll try to manage it if we can. Fortunately, they give you plenty of gas arrows just to kind of make it so it's not entirely unfair. Um, Alright. And this guy's probably going to notice, so we might need to knock him out. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Alright. Doing 
good so far. Two more gas arrows. Let's get that guy. Um, nah, I'm saving too much. Just try to stay off the main path if you can. Alright. And this is a good spot to save. Just save periodically because this level, it gets hard in some spots and it's not so hard in others. This right here is another spot where a ton of things are going to come through. And over here, if you keep running, you might accidentally fall off. But uh, I don't see anything just yet. But I'm kind of this is kind of like where you can look and see if anything's coming. And I don't see anything yet. That doesn't mean there isn't anything coming. If I sit here, let's see if this is hidden enough. Because I hear stuff moving. I don't know what's going on. I, did, did they stop? Is there a glitch going on? Oh, no. No, they're right there. Yeah, they did stop. Whatever. Uh, I'll take that for what it is. Uh, that was kind of advantageous. Okay, we'll just keep on going. Down we go. All right, and we definitely need to save before this. <laughs> this part's kind of fun. It's also really hard. So we cannot touch these uh, crystals over here. They will hurt you. Uh, but I am going to take these because we are going to need them in a second. Is there anything else? And I just heard some frogs, which is never a good thing. All right, and you slide on this. As you can kind of see, this is ice. So, and now I'm stuck. All right, come on, get out. There we go. All right, all right, let me grab that. All right, and just kind of get out of these things way that you don't have to worry about them. And we're gonna save real quick before this because this is, here we go. Not try that again. Whoa! God! <laughs> Man! Come on! Cut me some fucking slam! Man! never been that bad before where they're just like waiting for you all right I have to cut a huge chunk of that out <laughs> still got okay grab those It's like the fucking body wars in here. I thought you get I Garrett, I thought you said let's not try this again, man. Here we go. <laughs> Oh. Ow. I kind of want to 
wasn't supposed to happen. But we will continue. And the waterfall that flows up. Okay, up we go. What's up here? Anything? No? And this part gets a little tricky here. As you see, here we are at the bottom of this uh, lake here. Things are getting a little confined and I need to get some air here. No, 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 get, get over, get over, get over. Whew, oh, that was close. <laughs> So as you kind of saw, there was a pit there that was made of that crystal that hurts us if we touch it. And we couldn't get into it by climbing up through the sides. But if we, deli if we defy the laws of physics, we should be able to fall straight in. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, so that part of the mission is done. And now things get difficult again. Huh. Now that's big. Yep, that's a very large tree. And uh, as you can guess, the level would not be complete if we didn't have more fucking spiders to put up with. And let's see if we can uh, just take this dude out with the blackjack and <coughs> be done with him. Oh god, and another one! Easy something? <laughs> Who's there? Over there! Ah. He'll be back, but uh and lovely jump for joy. More spiders. Ah. Uh. Here comes that thing again. Come on. Okay. We can get most of those back. All right. We got them all before uh, they uh, noticed they were dying. And we got some healing fruit too. Yeah, there we go. I know I fired more than that in here. Okay. Let's hang on 
on to that for later. We got some healing fruit. And this thing that you can climb on. And there's a red spider over there. So don't sit still. God, these things are tough. There. Into the spider tree. All right. I can't remember. There was a path to proceed upwards with. I think there is. I think we need to go up the... Hold on. This level's very confusing. As you can see, I'm climbing on air. So anything is possible. I think. Okay, there it was. I was, I was like, did we... Whoa! Okay. Hold on. Let's see here. There we go. <laughs> and you know, this part here is it sucks you can sit here and try to contend with every spider you see but the best thing to do is just fucking high tail it the fuck out of here just don't stop just keep on moving there are so many fucking spiders in here you can't even count it just keep moving. Just keep moving. We're almost out. Up there. Haha, -ha, motherfuckers. Interesting. Come and get me over this, assholes. Ha <laughs> uh, Now this uh, I believe you're supposed to stay in the darkness and if you do so you will be okay just follow Indiana Jones and stay out of the light and that's what happens if you step in the light And we got, uh, walking over here. Come out, noisy tapper! out of broadheads. Oh my god, another one! What a bizarre place. We're 
We're almost to the source, guys. And here we are. We have arrived, folks. This is the Let's portal. Let's just disable that portal and give the hammers a fighting chance. This is the portal from which the bullshit is arising. Now that guy is not a threat, but that guy is. So let's just take care of that. So, to take care of the portal. What we need to do is we need to counter each of the elements that are on it. So fire is countered with water. Earth is apparently countered with air. Air is likewise countered with Okay. okay, there we go. Earth, and of course, water is countered with fire. The end. So, that is all of the portal. That's set, so we have now just saved Earth, but we are not out of the woods yet. We still must deal with El Trickstore himself. And look who Storm, it is. black and blow, swirly gust, rain winds flow, pushing dust, storm clouds grow, doxy clouds, lightning throw, misty shrouds, freezy snow. Call the storm, call the gray, bring thee forth world's old way. All right, and so here he is over here. He's getting all set up to unleash hell upon the earth here. Now the thing is, you can spend forever trying to walk in there and take the eye Flame and fail every time you try. Lazy sheep, black and or... You can take the stealthy route here, and you come up this way. Past not dead brings you forth. Past not dead. And then all you got to do is uh, just. Uh... Oh, that wasn't. I can't tell if that worked or not. Tide, rise and fall, river flood, rain. All right, hang on. I think I might have screwed that up, actually. break all, sea waves wash, swampy squall, sewer slosh, drain pipe stall. Drain pipe stall. Clog the toilet, clog the brine, brings he forth shits on rind. All right, now he can't see us up here. But what we need to do is get down there and exchange the eye uh, while well, he's got his back turned. And now is the time to... Stone grind and quick shatter tile column shake. Bring a pile chip and flake. And uh, soil windows. we pretty much are done here. We just need to let Constantine finish his ritual. I will... Uh, I will shut up and uh, let you kind of uh, experience the awesomeness of his wondrous poetry and spells. Looks like he's got just one more thing he, one or two more things he needs to do. So, yeah. Um, Night again, light, black brick lamp done with bright, dew and damp, smother tight, dark and high, fools he sight. Stay inside, fear the night, call the dark. 
Call the black, brings him forth, I call it back. <laughs> Stay inside, fear the night. Drain pipes clogged. And I don't know if he's supposed to be saying something there and the audio is just not working. I think he's just making his final preparations. Because I think there's one over there that hasn't been activated yet. So I think he's going to yeah, take care of that one first. Hmm. Open for me. Here we go. Open to me. Open my way. <laughs> Open for me. Open. It betrays me. <laughs> and there you have it, folks. The death of a god. Well, folks, it uh, it was a fun ride, and I am so glad for those of you who decided to take it with me. I've played this game I don't know how many times, but this was an exceptionally fun time that I've never experienced before, uh, creating a, a playthrough of this for me to share with the rest of the world. And I really hope you enjoyed. And if you didn't, thank you again just for watching. And uh, I intend to do a lot more of these. I want to do uh, the uh, next uh, game in the series, and I might start that immediately. I'm feeling rather... Uh, I've got a thief kit going on lately, but I also want to play Sanitarium, uh, which was recommended to me by Drinky Pie, who uh, is with Crash Test Gamers. Um, I also want to do a playthrough of the original Deus Ex and then the, um, the more current Deus Ex, uh, Mankind Divided, um, as well. And uh, for anybody who uh, watches this, if you have any uh, games you think that I should check out, uh, especially ones I haven't played before, uh, feel free to uh, uh, leave a recommendation. And uh, until then... Uh, thank you very much again, guys, and I hope you have a great fucking time. Whatever time of the day it is, I hope everything goes awesome. And if it's not, I hope it improves really fast. Thank you again so much, and let's just sit back and chill and watch the ending cutscene. noticed I just saved the world, yourself included. As we knew you would, as it had to be. Now I remember why I left the Keepers. And I remember why we let you go. What do you want from me? Have you come to congratulate me? Welcome me back to the fold? Very well. I will speak my piece plainly. You have accomplished that which was written, and yes, you've done it well. But there is no place for you with us any longer. Yet you will have a great need of us, and soon. I don't think so. 
I'm through with heroics. And with your kind as well. You cannot run from life as you did from us, Garrett. Life has a way of finding you, no matter how artistic a sneak you are. Listen, there is a book that you were not made aware of. I am here to tell you that it would be wise for you to read it now. But you can still read hieroglyphs. I do try to forget, but you keepers leave them everywhere for me. Yes. You have more friends than you know. Tell my friends that I don't need their secret book, or their glyph warnings, or their messengers. Tell them I'm through. Tell them it's over. Tell them Garrett is done. I will tell them this. Nothing has changed. All is as it was written. The trickster is dead. Beware the dawn of the Metal Age.